Hey everybody, we're here at Thoroughbred Racing on Sunday afternoon, February the 13th, and this is my Echo Base Winter Circle East Coast Racing Report. Let's go to the Big A first for their featured race 3, 124 p.m. Eastern Post Time. This is the Always Run Lucky Stakes, 6 furlong sprint on Aqueduct's winterized inner dirt track, 4 year olds and up, racing for $60,000. Contenders number five, Independence War. Number one, Temakula Creek. Number three, Deputy Daney. And number four, Calvello. Number five, Independence War takes a class drop. Is the overall speed leader in this field, sprinting at six furlongs on the dirt, has hit the board in power run fashion in each of his last five, including power run wins in both. His second and fourth race is back, which of course is indicative of a bounce pattern, folks. And the bounce would be up positive today if this pattern continues. Race 3 summary, number 5, Independence War, tops my contenders list, which also includes number 1, Temakula Creek, number 3, Deputy Daney, and number 4, Calvello, 5134 in the third from Aqueduct, the $60,000, always run lucky stakes. Go to Gulfstream Park in South Florida for their race 10 feature, 526 p.m. Eastern Post Time, this is the Hurricane Birdie Stakes. Six and a half furlongs on the dirt, grade three. Phillies and mares, four years old and up, racing for a stakes purse of $150,000. Contenders number one, Hilda's Mom, number, excuse me, Hilda's Passion, number six, Tar Heel Mom, number five, Miss Veneza, and number four, Jehan. Number one, Hilda's Passion. Nice early speed abilities for this sprint has hit the board in power run fashion in four of her last five, winning three times in this recent streak of racing consistency. Jockey Javier Castellano and trainer Todd Pletcher sent her to the post today. They've whacked the tote board with 56% of their entry saddle as a team to date. Number six, Tar Heel Mom qualifies as a power pony as the overall speed leader and has hit the board in power run fashion in five straight, including a pair of circle trips being embedded in this recent streak of racing consistency. Race 10 summary, number one, Hilda's Passion, tops my contenders list, which also includes number six, Tar Heel Mom, number five, Miss Veneza, and number four, Jehan, 1654 in the 10th today from Gulfstream Park, the $150,000 Hurricane Birdie Stakes. Bonus long shots, fabulous fairgrounds in New Orleans, race three. Number one, Kit Indy, an eight to one shot, takes a class drop of seven units. Good overall speed for this 8.3 furlong route test on the dirt. Tampa Bay Downs, race four, check out the 10 to one bomb. Number three, Skip and Win, takes a huge class drop of some 24 units. The speed leader in this maiden field, sprinting at six furlongs on the dirt. So handicapping for both Aqueduct and Gulfstream Park on a Sunday afternoon. Rick Needham for the Equibase Winter Circle reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it. <laughs>